Hey guys, this is a new form of uh, advertising in Taiwan. What is this? What do you think this is? Looks like a drink machine, right? But it, if it's a drink machine, where do you put the money? There's nowhere to put the money. All you have is a QR code reader, and that's it. So what this is, is if you install this free game, I think it's free. Let's, yeah, it's a, it's a free, you go to the app store, you install their free, free game, and then you show them that you've installed the game, and it will give you a free drink. So it's pretty funny. Like, if you just had, because I guess it'll make you a, a unique QR code for your game, for your phone, so you can't do it multiple times, I'm guessing. But yeah, it's just, it's just a way to get people to install their game and then hope that they get addicted and then hope they make in-app purchases. Hey guys, I'm 13 here. We're in a, what's kind of like a Walmart. It's a Care For. And my son's going to demonstrate this d device. Okay? Go GD. Anytime this year. You want male? You want both? That's male and female. Yeah, put on a dress. Put the red dress on. So what this is, is this is all the clothes that they have around here, and you can use this computer to get dressed. Put on a shirt or something, Judy. Don't change the hat, put on a shirt. Okay, put on a, get a purse. There you go. And look, it actually follows your hand around, so you can see what you look like without a hat. <laughs> okay. Slap a pink backpack on there. Wow, I'm impressed. That's crazy. Oh, there we go. <laughs> hey guys, so me and my friend, we just turned on like a random back alley. And at the very end of it, it's literally a dead end. And there is a name brand. It's a, what is it, Hollister and something? Or is it? Abercrombie and Fitch. Oh, Abercrombie and Fitch. Hollister, California. Like it's a name brand store and this at the at the end of a dead end and then the, and they had a bunch of clothes out the front there and I, and I was standing right by the clothes there's pairs of shoes I'm looking around for a security camera none nobody can I see anybody in the store no I could just grab whatever I want and on right next to the clothes too is a an expensive bicycle and it has a lock on it but the lock is just it's not it's it's not being used like the lock is just wrapped around underneath the seat it is, so it's, it has a lock, but it's not locked to anything. So you can just get on that bicycle there, which is a nice bike, and ride away. That's just Taiwan, man. People don't even bother locking their stuff. And then you have this here. This is what the, we're in a university area. This is evidently what the young girls wear nowadays. <laughs> are you waving at someone? Oh, the dog. Oh, that man, like, what are you, what are you waving to, man? It's a, Freaking sexy lingerie store, and you're waving to someone. Hey, you need, do you like those clothes? Hmm? Hey, look at the hair off its ears. That's crazy. Hey, hey. Oh, yeah, yeah, woman. Yeah, yeah, woman. Hey, hey. It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. I like your ears. Look at the ear hair. Look at the ear hair. Yeah. Want to smell my pants? I play with a lot of dogs. Can you smell? I played with at least five, six different dogs today. You're going to smell them all on there. Your ears kind of remind me of Trump's <laughs> hair. Yeah, it does. That's what Trump should do. He should grow out his air hairs and then use those as a comb over. It's not like he could look any uglier than he is. Hey, Aura, you're from Mexico, right? Look, yeah. they got phones just for Mexicans. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. That's not a Mexican. You should, you should have been like, oh, andale. I don't know. Say something Mexican. Say something Mexican. Um, burritos. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm the Junior. I'm at a Mexican food place. They do burritos, kind of like chip, chipot Chipotle, but it's called Pick and Eat. And they, they know how to do Mexican food right. Oops, let me get the focus. They know how to do Mexican food right here. Why? Because I'll show you why. Because they know if you want good Mexican food, you need a good bathroom with enough toilet paper holders to hold enough toilet paper for all the diarrhea you're going to get.
It's, it would look better if they were all full, but yeah, that's, that's funny. It's cool. This, I actually like this. You, you could actually fill up all of these, do this, fill them all up, and then when people, people would go into your house, use the bathroom, they'd, it, would, it looks cool, and then you'd have enough toilet paper to last a year without ever having to change a roll. You'd only have to like replace toilet paper once per year. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. Yeah. Yeah, it's a good idea. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. I know. <laughs>